So anyway, uh, why don't you give us a 30,000 foot view? What is Open Sense? What does it solve? Uh, and how did it come about? Um, well, it's uh, first of all, it is a firewall. Uh, it's a, it's a security platform as, as we we see it. Um, it's much more than it was in 2009, I think. Um, it developed quite a lot. Um, okay. We we do not only uh, try to prevent uh, getting bad people getting in your network, but also try to protect your network from uh, things getting out. So we have um, intrusion detection in it as well. Um, and besides that, we have uh, things like uh, traffic shaping, captive portal, uh, a lot of features that you can use for optimizing your network um, for stable network performance. Um, OpenSense is uh, it's, it's an open source project, as the name already says, it's open. Um, and it's a BSD license, two clause license uh, uh, project, which we find very important. That's one of the reasons why we forked the project. Um, well, how did how did it come about? I mean, why, why did you fork PFSense? I think there are quite a number of reasons why we forked. Um, in 2000, I think 2011, our competitor uh, uh, bought uh, the the, the PFSense brand, um, mm. and at that time we thought it it would be fine to work uh, together and to get the project uh, moving as as we did before. Uh, but we found out that uh, there are different motivations uh, behind the project. We wanted it to have an open source license. And when the tools were removed from the internet and the license changed, we found it the right time to fork the project and to keep it alive as it was before. Um, but also from a technical standpoint, we found a lot of issues with the software in the years before that we wanted to change. Uh, and that ne never happened. Um, and we found other people who thought the same. Uh, like uh, Franco, who's uh, one of the core developers. And we started working not only on the fork, but also on improving um, the software that was already there and include new things like an MVC framework um, and port codes to the uh, new GUI that we, we thought would be necessary for our product to stand out. 